Welcome to your classroom, wired for concurrent instruction. Note, this is just one way of setting up your classroom. You need to feel comfortable teaching in your own space, so any of this can be changed. Let's check out the setup. Your communication laptop will have the following hardware and software. And your facilitation station will be hooked up as such. But first, let's take a look at your communication station. The star of your communication station is your Logitech Meetup camera. Paired with BBCU, this will ensure all students at home will see and hear you and your instructional materials. Your Logitech Meetup camera is completely plug and play, so just plug it in and begin to play. There's no extra software. In BBCU, set up your microphone and camera as the Logitech Meetup external hardware. You can share this camera a few different ways with your students. You can share your camera the same way you've shared it for the past few months, but during concurrent instruction, I would suggest sharing your camera through your share content menu so students have a default larger view of you and your teaching on their at-home devices. How about that? The Logitech Meetup camera comes with a great remote. You can have up to three presets, the first of which is your default home. This zooms out to a wide angle view, great for movement activities or during specials. Presets 1 and 2 can be set up however you want them. I have set up preset 1 to zoom in to the smart board and showing you and your teaching materials. Preset 2 I have set up to be a carpet read aloud, but like I said, you can customize this however you'd like. Just set your camera to how you want a preset and press and hold that button until you hear this sound. Now let's talk about managing your communication station. Having BBCU on your communication station will ensure that you can see and address questions in both the chat and with raised hands. Building student autonomy with lowering hands and turning off their microphones when they aren't in use will be very necessary when you have two sets of students to manage. Another skill to teach them was their at-home view settings when you are sharing content. In the upper left corner of your content, they can zoom into or out of the content you share, in this case your camera, so they can see your smart board or your glasses fog up with your mask. Now on to your facilitation station. This will be your FCPS issued device that hooks up to your projector, smart board, and document camera if you have one. In my BBCU scheduler, I have invited my fcpsschools.net account as a moderator so I can be logged in twice. If this is something you want to do as well, just make sure your speakers are turned off, otherwise you'll have a bad echo. Once in front of your classroom, just teach how you normally would to a classroom full of students. If necessary, you can also share content the way you have the last few months. That way, in-person students and at-home students can have a very similar viewing experience. That's it for the concurrent classroom technology setup and management tutorial. Like I said, this is how I would set up my classroom, but this is completely customizable for how you want to teach. So please don't hesitate to reach out with questions, requests, and or ideas. This is Matt Stewart, signing off.